First, though, we're clearing up confusion on who can get a vaccine and where they can get it. It seems to change by the moment. This is News 6 at 11. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. A lot has changed in the last 24 hours, starting with a major announcement from the governor. He says starting next week, the state is lowering the age for vaccinations to 60 and older. Meantime, in Orange County, the mayor says law enforcement of any age can now get the shot, despite the governor's current executive order, which states people have to be 50 and older. New 6's Troy Campbell is live outside the Orange County Convention Center tonight, where people from newly eligible Eligible groups have been getting inoculated all day, Troy. Well, Lisa, that's because Orange County Mayor Jerry Deming says this site is now running under the guidance of the federal government, not Governor Ron DeSantis. He says this site simply wasn't filling all of its available appointments. So he hopes by adding um, a larger amount of people who qualify for the vaccine, it can guarantee that the county won't waste any shots. Yes, I am happy. <laughs> Educators of all ages in Orange County receiving their COVID-19 vaccine at the convention center. Teacher Christine Quintana says she's thankful the site expanded its eligibility. I'm really excited that finally we got to get vaccinated. So as soon as I heard that teachers had the opportunity to come, I made my appointment. Orange County Mayor Jerry Deming saying the county is following the guidance set forth by the Department of Health and Human Services. And as supply of the vaccines increases, he'll add groups to the list despite the state's guidance through Governor Ron DeSantis. Primarily, we are able to expand the eligible uh, group because of the um, under capacity uh, that we have here at the convention center uh, within the last uh, several weeks. Orange County health officials say the convention center groups also now include law enforcement officers of any age and those deemed high risk by their doctor. We have the vaccines. There is need in the community, so we are responding to that. The U.S. Department of Veteran Affairs announcing veterans of any age can make appointments with the VA at locations in Orange, Volusia, and Brevard counties. Teacher Barbie Schleschler says she feels relieved moments after receiving her shot. It's been a long year, so glad to be moving on. And the county said its goal is to inoculate 3,000 people here a day. The county said it would not reach that goal today. Now, all appointments here are done online. We have that link on clickorlando.com. Live in Orlando tonight, Troy Campbell getting results. News 6. Troy, thank you.